Welcome to the Hard Hat Training Series. Today we will be learning about steps you can take to protect your general health and safety while on board a marine vessel. This training will give you the tools and knowledge you need to be a healthier, safer seafarer. Thanks to popular television shows, we all know that working at sea is a deadly occupation. Besides accidents, seafarers are at risk for a number of diseases and health hazards. The physical nature of onboard work, changes in climate and weather, the type of cargo, long and inconsistent working hours, and material handling can all take a toll on your body and mind. Personal habits such as hygiene, diet, exercise, and stress management also affect your physical and mental well-being. Endemic and epidemic diseases are also a concern. There are no medical professionals on board to take care of you if you fall ill. It is essential, then, that you take preventative measures to keep yourself safe and healthy. Being a sailor has always been a hazardous job. In the 19th century, it wasn't unusual for minor cuts and abrasions to become infected. Left untreated, these infections would grow and spread, resulting in amputations. Tetanus, gangrene, and other infections were common. Additionally, there were several diseases that were caused by poor diet. Scurvy, caused by a vitamin C deficiency, was prevalent among seamen until the mid-1800s. Scurvy causes exhaustion, pale skin, irritability, swollen gums, joint pain, and bone loss. Similarly, osteomalacia, a softening of the bones caused by vitamin D deficiency, was also prevalent at the time. It led to bowed legs and fractures. 